Hello, what's up? This is Tyler. In this video I will unbox the Lenovo S850 with the 5 inch HD Gorilla Glass 3 and the 4.4.2 KitKat out of the box. This phone is perfect for people who are looking for a high quality phone in a compact size. I purchased it on geekvita.de with the DHL local shipment and local service and the shipment took only 3 days. As always have a look below in the video description and my blog for all the details. So let's see what we have here. So first we see it's packed very well. So nothing can happen. And uh, here we have the phone. We have here a quick start guide. And we also have here a power adapter for your country. So that's really nice. And here let's have a quick look on this. I think this is standard. And here we see the box, Lenovo. S850. The phone comes with the MediaTek MTK6582 quad core chipset clocked at 1.3 GHz. Inside, we also find 1 GB of RAM and 16 GB of ROM. On the camera part, we find a 13 megapixel rear camera with Sony sensor and a 5 megapixel front camera. So, let's have a look here on the back side. So, we see the web shop. And we also see some text in Chinese here and the homepage. So here on this side here we see the model number, see the storage and we see it's from 2014. And uh, we also see here that the box is sealed. So let me open this. So first we have here the phone. And as you notice, this is the white version. Let me put this aside and let's have a look on the rest in the box. So here we also have, I think this must be some kind of warranty card, mostly in Chinese. Then also we have here a user guide, a manual. Also in Chinese, let's see, then we have here the SIM tray opener. We also find here the wall charger, branded with Lenovo. And this one, of course, will fit inside here. Okay. Then we have here a standard micro USB, USB cable. This looks to be pretty good, actually, it's not that bad. And here we also then have some earphones. So here we see the earphones from Lenovo. Let's have a look here. And let's see if we have here a button. We have here a microphone and it's also a button, as you notice. So uh, that's it for the unboxing. Let's have a closer look now on the phone. Let me remove this and let us have a look. First we see there's a screen protector on the display, so that's why you see all the bubbles here. Let me try to remove this. have a look here so it looks really really nice really good and high quality good build quality it seems to be so uh, here on the back we also have some plastic let me just remove this
And let us first have a look here on the back side. We see here the Lenovo back logo here and this is also a notification LED. So this can light up. We see here the 13 megapixel rear camera and a LED flash. The back side is made of uh, glass as you can hear. So we have Gorilla Glass 3 both on the back on, and on the front. Let's have a look on the front. We see here Lenovo. See, see here the speaker and the front facing camera on 5 megapixel. We have a proximity sensor. We have here a 5 inch HD screen and the resolution is 1280 by 720. Below here we see three touch buttons. In the bottom we have the microphone. In this side here we have a speaker. And uh, we have here the SIM tray. Here we have the micro USB and we have the 3.5 mm headphone jack. On this side we have the power button and the volume rockers. So as you notice there's no back speaker. We placed the speaker here in the side as told, so that's pretty special. So let me do a 360 degree turn around here, so you can see the design. And uh, already now I can say that I really like this phone. The design is stunning, uh, I really like the compact size, it feels good in the hand. And I have great expectations to this model as I really like the look of the Lenovo UI. I like the double sided uh, glass design, we have a notification LED in the back logo as told and um, according to Lenovo uh, it's a three dimensional texture on the glass back here. It's using the Mali 400 GPU and uh, this phone is also a dual sim. So a thing I have to mention is that you can't of course remove the, the back here so um, the battery is built in, you can remove that. Let's have a look here now on the boot up and the phone, see if it has any battery left. And let me choose here English language. So that looks nice. Looks like a nice UI. And the speed seems to be good. Because we have also support for themes and wallpapers. The viewing angle seems also to be pretty nice. So uh, that's it for now. I will soon be back with a full review of this device and show all the nice features. If you have any questions or special requests, please comment below, give a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my next video.